The alarm clock rang. It's time to wake up, have breakfast, and then go to work. Will this daily routine make you at the peak of your activity in the morning before going to work? I don't think so. There are some people to whom the term morning people applies who are used to doing some healthy activities in the morning, making them start their day actively and energetically. Unlike people who wake up with the same morning routine that makes them feel lethargic all day, so that they do not have that activity that makes them go towards creativity and innovation. Annie Dillard, an American novelist, says that the way we spend our days determines the fate of our lives. She spoke a little. In general, as studies have recently proved that it is precisely the way we spend our mornings really determines the fate of our lives. In this podcast, we will mention the most important scientifically proven morning habits that creative people do daily, which changed the course of not only their mornings for the better, but also their lives. First, meditation. Meditation is an excellent sport that can be practiced at any time of the day, but the best way to do it is early in the morning, and it is one of the sports that become a habit for morning people. It makes their mind clear. And prevents them from thinking about any positive or negative thought. There is a distinctive type of meditation known as open monitoring, which makes a person conscious through thinking. That is, to make him fully conscious allows him to focus on all the thoughts that emanate from within only and control them away from the thoughts that come from the people and things around him. Thus, he will be able to observe thoughts or beliefs that make him a happy or sad person, active or inactive, motivated or frustrating. And how to control them. Secondly, disable phone notifications. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and others are some of the most undesirable habits that people do in the morning. Is to look at inbox notifications or social media applications such as Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and others. This negative habit, which morning people certainly do not do, is the main reason for the failure in the time management process. If the first thing your mind sees in the morning is people's comments or what they posted on their Facebook pages, for example, your mind will be distracted from the tasks that you should do as soon as you wake up from sleep. So we advise you to disable all phone notifications and allocate five minutes out of every hour to check your inbox or social networking sites, or while you are eating at break time only. Third, drink enough coffee. Drinking any kind of coffee in the morning is a good day for you to start your work, as caffeine is the flavor of the morning for a high percentage of people. Drinking a good amount of it makes the mind alert, but most importantly, it increases the secretion of the hormone dopamine, which in turn gives you a feeling of motivation and reward when inventing ideas through the creativity window inside your mind. Fourth, follow the passion. Steve Guber, one of the founders of Apple. Said, when I wake up every day in the morning, I go to the mirror and ask myself, if this was the last day of my life, would I want to do what I do every day? Ask yourself this question, and if the answer is no, know that you have to make a big change in your life. If you are working in a job that you do not prefer, make your goal bigger and do not continue it for a long period of your life, even if it is excellent in many aspects, whether material or psychological. Follow your passion. Do not hesitate to work to have a freelance job of your own choosing that expresses your personality. Fifth, wake up quietly. The key to creative ideas is not only in the number of hours you sleep, but in how you wake up too. This may mean that you need to get away from staying up late and set your alarm 30 minutes earlier than usual. And although this may be a small change, it's worth experimenting for creative insights that will be gained. However, make sure you get enough sleep. It not only improves your degree of attention, but is also associated with increased activity in the right hemisphere of the brain, which is closely related to creativity.